Okay, and we're back. Wow, we took a pretty long break from this game, didn't we? I, I missed it so what much. Is, what is this game again? Uh, Ghost Hall? Oh, Ghost Recon. Wildlands. The guy's like, hey, I'm a drug dealer. I'm gonna shoot you with this RPG, and that's the whole game. I haven't played it. You pick who, as long as they're a drug dealer. You pick how, but that's mostly guns. What about what about a different gun though? No, just the one. Oh, there's our dog. He's a potato gun. How do I say good boy? Your lips. Uh, is his nose clipping through your your leg? You dirty dog. Go here. So we last left our adventure. So I could edit a bad tunes in three different commissions. Uh, we were being chased by that glass wielding robot lady. But I think we got a key. Hold on. I remember there was something on here. In the future, we'll try and do these more in like one like sitting. If three truths exist, it must be so that three lies also exist. So the left is lies and the right is true? I, I believe this is, we got the key last time. We, we climbed up a fucking dragon and an ice pillar and we got the Jupiter key. Awesome. He was mad about something. He's mad about you. Crap. Get in there, get in there. Paul Reiser's coming, and he's not happy. You okay, dog? I guess false alarm, Huey. Awesome, thank you. Beat the shit out of him, but no, not really. You sure, because I can give him a kick? Don't kick your dog. What are you boys up to? Playing chess. A pair of creepy wax figures. Those don't look like wax. Those look like dead bodies. Well, the movies and also reality because we've seen some pretty fucked up shit so far. I hope, I hope there's some haunting in this haunting ground. What is... Okay, so she's here. Whoa, whoa. Goodbye. I gotta use a, an item. <laughs> Ghost Recon, minefield attack, go! Come on, come get me, lady. Wow. Wow. Finally. It did nothing. <laughs> it did. It was. It was not effective. I'm gonna try a little rope a dope, dosey -si do action on her. Get in. Get in. Get in. Come on. I'd better hide. Do you think this is like Metal Gear Solid? You know how Snake his grip can actually increase over the game by uh, like jumping over railings and holding on to the side. Maybe Fiona can learn to open and close doors a little bit quicker. No. Oh, that's right. My kids, I forgot to build them. I'm a bad mom. She must have jumped in the oven. Well, that solves that problem. I better jump in there after her. Hello, dog. Hello, I dog who keeps biting me. I'm glad we've forged this deadly alliance. Coast clear. I'm sorry. It's what? Like, we're like, we're like 10 episodes into this, right? Uh, yeah. I'm still not over that fucking Austin Powers ass font. I think it's more like a Simpsons font. 
And I know that because to make the thumbnails, I download the Simpsons fonts. It burns fiery red hot like my passion. A massive hourglass. Eh, it's an okay hour. Would you call that massive? Is it an hour? Because that seems like more sand than an hour. I mean, I've been to Target and they have those like on sale for like 25 bucks. Where do you think they got them? But I'm just saying like, I whoa, oh, oh, Huey, you snitch. I'm Huey not called me on my codec to tell me the coast was clear. And then I opened the door and they're both standing there. Again, we got this f fucking experimental Brian Eno. David Byrne music going on. I feel like I'm gonna fight a boss in Splatoon. My life in the haunted castle. My life is a teenage robot, my favorite Brian Eno song. Wait. Okay, I can hide behind this ice pillar. No, you can't. Sub Zero, you tricked me! No, Sub Zero did a sneak attack. I guess I just live in this closet now. The rest of this Let's Play is going to be this closet, the game. And here he walks through the front door. Then he looks at the front door. Then he looks at the closet. And I'm trapped in the closet. Now he looks at the front door. Shows the audience his butthole. He's done showing his butthole. I'm still trapped in the closet. Yep. What a riveting gameplay. Okay. Well, it didn't say coast clear, so. She's going to be right outside that I'm fucking I'm taking door. my life. My I hope not. I hope Fiona will be like, hey, look. I see her through... Okay, good, she's not. I heard something. Jupiter. Uh, but, but? Uh Oh, I see. Three lies must exist. So I sp I spot one right away. They were not in in such a dynamic pose in the other room. Also they didn't vibrate. That's a new feature. That's the deluxe model. Creepy Wax Figures, version 1.1. They now have a rechargeable battery and the skinless children vibrate. Uh, do you think you'll release a patch for a uh, skin? No, 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 no. That would defeat the purpose of skinless children. Fucking Bethesda. That hourglass seems off. Because in the other room, it was out, wasn't it? Yeah, but also... Our glasses, uh... This isn't massive, this is just merely big! Yeah, the hourglass, like, gravity. Of course it moved. Was- yeah, there wasn't a- What the fuck? The chessboard is different. Yeah, there was like a cup or something on it, and now it's gone. <laughs> cup to rook. Stone Cold Steve Austin. You know, I'm just gonna point this out. Is in the fiction of the game, am I doing this with my mind? This puzzle works when I notice things. Way to go, Capcom. Well, that's not a cup. That's the flask, just like in front of it, I guess. And the camera angle just makes it look like there's a cup on no, it. No, it was a cup. You were right the first time. They were playing Yahtzee. 
<laughs> the difference is you you flip it around and it's got Chinese checkers. That's why it's a hexagon. Hi, bud. Right up the right up the hole. Come on. Maybe you're supposed to talk to her. Like, Are we hey, good now? I noticed that you you moved the chess pieces. I guess that makes like I beat the game. Hey, so friends. Sorry, I was trying to murder you. I was really cold. <laughs> I was gonna jump in you like a tauntaun, but you know what? Then I'm like, oh hey, I got I got some fire starter logs. Bought them with a coupon at Lowe's. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, we cool, right? Oh no, Andy, she's a twisted fire starter. Hey, hey, hey. Bow, wow, wow, wow. Hey, the poker's not hot anymore. Also, it looks like it's a different shape. <laughs> she stabs you with it and you're like, ha, huh, it's not even hot. Please take me to a hospital. <laughs> Wouldn't it be great if she got hit by- Okay, yeah, she can just face through them. No, she's just walking around them. Unlike the last guy, she's not a fucking drunk homunculus. Come here, did we unlock this door yet? I don't know. Uh, it's been a long time. It's been a couple of weeks. How do you calm down in this game? You take a shit or something? You smoke some weed, obviously. Great. I forgot that it can get me in my grabbing animation. Huey, you might want to... Yeah, get her! Okay, I think I read somewhere that this works, that you can just hide behind doors. Just in case, let's see if there's any items we can use. Looks like you've got some big red. Where? Uh, above chamomile? Chamomile? I didn't read what it did. Is it, am I, is that, am I smoking out? I think you just ate a cigarette. Oh, you've got to refine that shit, I think. Okay. Well, let's go back to that room where she attacked me with the poker, because something should be different there, I hope. Maybe there's another poker, and you can use it. Wait, that room we went to was new. Do you think it just unlocked all the doors that we had locked? Could be. Because remember, the cutscene to Fiona was like, <gasps> like she heard stuff, you know, all over. By the way, we are using our new microphones uh, in this Let's Play. Uh, I think I say that in every Let's Play. But if it, in every Let's Play, we buy new microphones. If it sounds bad, we'll there is the them. no. There's the loudest goddamn system in the world. That's what away from us. We are playing this game on a PS3, uh, launch day PS3. But you know, it's the one that's backwards compatible. Now you might be wondering why aren't we using an emulator on the P uh, on the personal computer? Well, the fact is is that while it makes the game look sharper, it doesn't handle reflective surfaces very well. I saw a let's play of someone do this uh, game and every mirror looked like what a test card 
for like when a TV goes off air, you know? When you're watching when you're watching uh, network television at five in the morning and they I'm, play the national anthem and then that scary clown comes up. I think what Chris means to say is that it's illegal and it's wrong. There are words written here. Dead spirits craving for life, crawling back from the underworld. No one can blame you for walking away. Sip of the fresh flowing lifeblood. When your thirst is quenched, return to the darkness from whence you came. So we knew this game was brought to you by Jack Lynx, but is it also brought to you by Sprite? Who's a thirst quencher? Is that Sprite? I don't think Sprite advertises itself as lifeblood. Press X to squint. Oh no, it's the clown box. Andy, quick, give it a cell phone. <laughs> oh no. If it drops a puzzle, do not go near it. Paper. Paper. You have to admit, that is one swanky looking Porter John. It seems really hard to shit in though. <laughs> Did we ever get a key? Nope. Is that Venus? Was it a symbol? Yeah. See, I, I don't know my runes. I, I only know Venus and Mars. Were they on an album cover or something? No, it's men are from Mars, women are from Venus. So the female symbol is Venus and... I never knew that. Male symbol is Mars. I never knew that. Yeah. Are, are they really? Yeah. I, I, think. I know the male and female symbol. I did not know no, the equation. You know, to you know the reason why I know that. Because that. Because in Austin, book? in Austin Powers, he has the Mars symbol on his necklace, and it's because Austin Powers is from Mars. Yeah, baby. Show me to your leader. No, it's because he's Sailor Mars. Moon Tiara magic, baby. Which is why in the fourth Austin Powers movie, he fucks Tuxedo Mask. Whoa! She is Sh quick! Shit, she's just pretty like a linebacker. She's gonna sack me. But bitch, I'm the QB. And now I'm going to QT to get me a cherry limeade. Me and Huey are going to QT. <laughs> Man, this game is just a shitty Dead by Daylight. Just kidding. Dead by Daylight is a shitty Dead by Daylight. Okay, I think this door was locked before, and it is now open. No, we've been through here. Fuck. Oh? Uh? Wait a second, what's what? Oh, that's right, I want to open these because she hates mirrors. Even though she's walking around with a big hunk of glass from a mirror. Well, not anymore, now she has a poker. Oh, that's true, she upgraded. Yeah, look upon yourself and weep. Behold the ravages of age. Do you think if she sees all of them, she'll like die or something? Or do you think it's just like, a temporary distraction. Because uh, it's those, a temporary distraction. But those break. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she smashes them. So like, this so you game's only hard. get a few. Yeah. Oh, that sucks. And if you save too many times, you don't get to unlock Akuma. Oh, you can't go in there and shut the door. Great game. Awesome. Mm -hmm. I don't want to go there. Oh, shit. I guess I should have gone there. Have we been down here? Doesn't I, look I familiar. Do not look so, I do not look so. Wouldn't you have smashed that shit? Shit. Oh, god damn those blue things. I hate them. Oh, and now we're locked in the room with the mythical beast. Good. 
good mythical morning. Oh, there's a, a shiny in its mouth. And there's a shit with a poker in here. I mean, there's a bitch. I'm so- A shit. I'm so upset. Guys, watch but, out, there's a shit. There's a shit. Stop being a shit, is, lady. Is everything in this game a porta potty I guess according to Chris. According to Chris, the world is a porta potty Is that a Walla medallion? Oh, the camera's becoming my enemy again. It's doing that thing where like, get her. You can't see me. Damn, she's got some funky fresh moves though. Oh, now she's the protagonist. She can pop and lock. The camera follows her, so I guess you control her now? Chris, I, I know I know where to find her. She's behind the door. <laughs> you got a hot tip. She has that a hot tip too. That Damn poker. It. I'm sorry. Oh fuck, she's coming back. She's like, you probably shouldn't have said that joke so loud, Chris. Now I know where you are. I can hear your commentary, assholes. This is like Manhunt. Is that Brian Cox? What did she just say? Was she singing? She said Miss Fiona. Oh, Miss Fiona, uh. please give me your lady parts. Yeah. I, I think we established in the, like she's jealous of our lady parts, right? She's like, I'm incomplete. I'm like a Barbie doll. I'm all smooth down there. Instead of a valley, I've got a mound. What's this? The weeping stone. We call those weeping stones. General and Broncos is an underrated movie. Don't vest the Eska. Suffering Thakatash. Hey, yo, oh, give me back my Esther. It's my favorite aunt. A stuffed chimera. Also, chimeras exist in this universe. She's like, why would someone decorate a room with something so hideous? A better question is, why would you fill an incredibly small room with a giant statue? I thought minotaurs were like big. It's just a regular dude. No, these are minotaurs. That's why they're small. You're thinking of big o tours. I can only handle a medium tour. Okay, so what did we just pick up? Oh, good. It's for medallions. Boring. But we can save. Oh, good. What are we saving? The fact that the enemy now has a much better weapon? You got a good point. Let's roll this back. Let's roll this back to the beginning of the game before we get captured and we're good. Or roll it forward to the end credits. You remember when we had a dog? Whatever happened to that? I want to know is what happened to that Robot Jones guy? Okay, so remember we unlocked the shortcut here. Some combinations can be used to aid animals as well. Here are a few. Eska slightly restores all animals lost stamina. Uh, stamina. Sylvester Eska awakens an animal true inner strength. 
Well, it just said what they do, lady. I wonder what it means. Can you just put on that mask already? Jojo my way out of here? Just reject your humanity and you're good. Muda, muda, muda. I hate that. I really do. Because it sounds like he's like... Oh. Sounds like a dance. And again, remember, if you don't want to bother animating someone climbing down, don't. Cut to black. It should just be a text-based game then. Fuck. Are we never free of this lady? I think last time we tried to come down here, she was, yeah, she was swinging. Boys keep swinging. What if we just hit her with a different chandelier? <laughs> yeah, it was pretty funny. Can we get the ghost to grab her? Grab her ghoulies, why don't you? She's already grabbed ours. Good boy. The, who'd I say that to? The hand? Thank you, thing. Holy fuck, she's fast. She, when she wants to be, and then she's doing the fucking electric slide all the other times. Wouldn't you? Yeah, you got a point. She comes in and she's like, whoa, too creepy. I'm out of here, lady. Oh, have we been down here? I don't think so. I remember that dead guy, and also a shiny I haven't stolen. Nope, nope, no. Mm -mm. What about that lever? I don't want to be your friend. I do not want to be your friend. Man, this is such a good fucking aspect of this game. Yep. Uh, it's not already... <sighs> you get chased by a blue thing, and it's really scary. Well, I guess let me burn that chamomile I just got so that when this thing hits me, I don't freak the hell out. Oh, that's cool. It's in the next page. Can you do that? Nope. Cameo is just for stamina. It's not for crybaby hissy fit routines, I guess. Fiona's not gonna have fucking knees at the end of this adventure. If you're mad, Cotton Hill. <laughs> she makes it out like, oh, I've made it out of that creepy mansion. She looks down and both her kneecaps are just exposed. There's no flesh. Maybe that's what happened to those, uh, those skinless guys. They kept tripping and all their skin just fell right off. Huge spikes just out from inside the Iron Maiden, rendering the oh. device unusable as maybe, a hiding place. Maybe that's what that lever does. Well, that's what she thinks. I'm jumping the spikes. Wow, Fiona. Huh, this torture room has a bird cage. Huh, it's a little big. God, this has got to be the dumbest hiding place in a video game ever. We already saved, right? I'm gonna hide in this fucking Iron Maiden. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk it. <laughs> Those spikes are gonna pop up any second now. A corpse. This person was heavily tortured. Yeah, sure. I like to gamble. Oh, cutscene. This bodes well. They tortured him till he would tell him the location of the mercury key. <laughs> it's 
on my neck. I told you 26 times. <laughs> Idiot, that's Venus. Haha, <laughs> got you again, stupid. Oh no, I got attacked by my least favorite Mortal Kombat character. That was actually all of the energy I had left, so I'm gonna go ahead and die now, but it was fucking worth it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Hey, can you turn that down? I'm trying to die peacefully. Hi! I'm one of those redads from Zelda. I see you met the toilet ghost. We're all the hits. Let me know when you fight the giant spider. Okay, so there- hmm. Is this a tool used to torture innocent victims? Looks kind of like a statue, but okay. Fire is essentially composed of hotness and dryness. <laughs> no one fucking knows. It differs only from the fire in that it is formed of moistness. I'm sorry, dryness. Earth is and fire are, without doubt, both in possession of dryness. Water differs from air in the fact that it does not contain heat. Coldness is the component that separates fire from earth, yet it is dryness that separates the earth from water. And so, by linking these four elements together, it is said that the fundamental Carina Aura, Aurea? Aurea, Carina Aurea, or alchemic bond, is formed. That which binds flesh and spirit together for an infinitum. Is it an infinitum? I thought it was ad infinitum. Like in Latin, I don't, it's ad infinitum. I don't fucking not know. Not an infinitum. Hotness and dryness form the elements of fire. What could it mean? Let's get that dog in here. Where is that dog of mine? Get that corpse to do it. Hey, I'll help you out. Um, was this the voice I was using? I can't remember. Sorry, I'm dying. I'm very out of it. Let's do all our character voices for this one guy. Okay. <laughs> hey, what's up? I'm Don Patch. Wait a minute. Dawn Patch cheated. Cheat, cheat, cheat. Fiona, are you ever gonna learn? I'm just gonna keep pranking you. What was that name? The Micro Machines racing game, but you raced on your, like, like, you race dudes. Micromaniacs. Micromaniacs. That think, game rules. Do you think this dude is getting sick of us doing our own little Micromaniac stunt show in front of him? Where we blare, like, unlistenable music and just do laps? These Micromaniacs are quite macro. Come on. Come on. Where the hell are you, dog? You're not really a Micromaniac. You're oh, more the door of a... Sh shut. You're more of a, uh, like, slightly less tall than the average woman. I don't, I don't really know if I'd consider you a maniac. Good boy. Go. Unless you're a Hulkamaniac. I assume we are. No. This Come game on. was made when? Early 2000s? Maybe? Come on. No, no, that's way too... Probably mid two thousands, right? Come on. Like two thousand five or so. Two thousand five, two thousand six. So I mean, that was before the Bubble the Love Sponge debacle. So yeah, she'd be a she'd be Hulk maniac. Fresh off the Mister America gimmick. Huey, where the? F you are really testing my patience, boy. Miss. I'm eating your dog. Ah, <sighs> see, we're we're getting close to solving a puzzle, so I don't want to end the episode. But we're, uh, we're at like forty minutes. Yeah, we're almost at forty minutes. Oh, and she's here. She might end the episode for us. I'd rather she didn't. Yeah, get it. Be like a cat and climb it up. 
Climb up there, come on. But it's cold. Oh, see, it does work. See, she doesn't see me. She definitely, she definitely sees me. Yeah. She knew exactly, I don't know why the camera changed, but she knew exactly where to find me. This is a very good game. I'm having a lot of fun here. I like this game. Cause I get to play it and not watch it. Maybe that's the difference between me and Andy. So, uh, those Oscars, huh? That was a mix up, right Andy? Huh? Yeah. The, they sure pulled a, they, they pulled a uh, Lee Cedric the Entertainer. They sure pulled the Lee Harvey Oswald on that one. You and Ryan Gosling got shot by Jack Ruby? The look on his face. I was surprised to see Warren Beatty there. I thought he passed away. I thought those FBI agents gunned him down in that old timey T bird. Shit, is that what they were called? No, not T bird, Model T. Shit. Remember when Bonnie, cool. remember when Bonnie and Clyde had a bitch in sports car? Yeah. Remember when, when like fucking Clyde was like, check out this cool uh, T-Bird, it's, it's a classic car. And then Bonnie was like, absolutely no it is not. This car is from the future. Come on. Okay, down is the get your shit together Huey button. I'll keep that in mind for when I upload my let's play of this game. Was that always bloody? I think we're on the opposite side. Whoa. Because he doesn't like what we just saw. Is that red rum? No, it's red, red wine. Look at his little bounce. Oh, cool. So we're cool again. We're back to being friends. Miss Fiona. Filthy little princess. Uh... <laughs> Coming soon from Hasbro. Filthy little princess. Wasn't that Courtney Love's biopic? A small present from the Lord of the Manor. A Hebbles perfume! Looks like a Christmas light. Okay. Just well, as long as it's not Ivanka's. I'm boycotting that. Miss, it's cleaning time now. Every new beginning comes from some other beginning's end. She's got to clean her filthy little princesses. They collect a lot of dust. My filthy princess, take my life. God, that dog is just... I can't take him anywhere. She's a filthy little princess with a sissy bar, and she lays a patch on the tar. She's a filthy little princess with a sissy bar, and she lays a patch on the tar. What was that, uh... And she shoots the puck to Huey, but Huey, he's just a dog. She's a filthy little princess with a sissy bar, and she lays a patch on the tar. He's a dink. I like her. I've got problems. Man, that would be perfect if she came back and started doing that weird, like, crazy music. Right at that point. Because, like, the end of the song does a... Du -du -du -du. Okay, I'm so... I get lost so easily in this goddamn game. They might be giants, got lost...